today we're going to show you the most common spring fruit and they so look so weird. So first we have the biwa and it's like this Japanese fruit and orange and it has some hair and then there's also like a smaller version of that. Then you can't even find in the street on a tree. Hi, so this is biwa fruit and the leaf is big. Oh, this is pure and the orange are fresh ones and there is one orange with, which I found okay. and over, over there is red yellow one and here there's more than one red deal almost So first is the big one, and there's also big ones and small ones, and they look so different, <laughs> like a different type of fruit. And then we have ume, which is so popular, and it's really good when you put it on syrup. And it also is hairy, like this one, and it smells so good, like cherries and some flowers. It's really nice. <laughs> Good smell, right? Yeah, it's also. This it smells is delicious. So, and this here mm. is pepper and does not look like pepper at all, but actually is. So, here, and they're very small and tiny. And I'm, I don't want to try it because it might be like spicy, but... It is like a little spiky, like a dot. It doesn't have any spikes. Like a dot. Oh, look, 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 this is how it is inside. It's like a real black pepper inside. And it actually grows on a Japanese pepper. Yeah, there is like bumps. And then we have so many different types of tomatoes here. There's like yellow and green and different shapes. And, and this one is so suspicious. It looks like a strawberry. I thought it was a strawberry without the seeds, but it's actually a tomato in a really weird shape. And maybe some of you might have thought that tomatoes are a vegetable, but they're actually, actually fruits because they have seeds in them. But this is orange. Yeah, it's like a micro pumpkin. And then we have yellow and green. And this is my favorite. I like the color so much. <laughs> Other seed. Yeah, there's. You there's cut seed. seed. I yeah. cut the seed out of it here. Inside seed is white. Yeah, inside of the seed, and they're really big, the seeds. I think we'll have to take this out. And there's another seed on the other side. Alex, be I thought there'd be also orange inside, but it's like black and white. <laughs> and we just cut the tomatoes and try green. Yeah, I'll just try the green one. I think it tastes the same, but I'll just... I don't want it to taste. It's so sour. Yeah, I want sour. It's so sour, Mom. I want sour. I want it's sour. really sour. Very sweet. I think my tongue is really sensitive. Then my tongue is eating sweets. Oh yeah, I was eating a lot of sweets before this video. Now we're going to try the oven and I'm really scared. Do you try it first? You try it first. I tried already. It's it just so sour and disgusting. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like it at all. It's so sour. 
May I? It's no. pepper. No, it's very spicy. It's spicy? Yeah, it's very spicy. Don't eat it. I, because this is um, used to like put in the syrup, so it's really sour if you eat it. But never try that alone. <laughs> never ever. I can, Maybe I you can put some on pizza, but don't overdo it because it's so spicy. No, it's inside the pepper. So thanks for watching, and please comment down below if you know any other of this fruit for spring and if you ever like tried it, some of these and please tell me like how you felt after eating these if you ate i think they'll also be super spicy for you thanks for watching bye bye